Hey guys, and welcome to the one where there's no better time than the present. All right, so I was gonna film like a proper vlog today, but then today happened and I didn't film anything. So I'm just gonna film a quick video here talking straight into the camera like I do. So the thing that I wanted to talk about today and one of the things that kind of came up in my mind when I did the live stream with Chris Shaw and, uh, on Monday is that there's really no better time to start doing what you're passionate about than now. I made a video last week about time management and I've been talking a lot about trying to get better at code and trying to get writing done and working on these projects that I have uh, going through my brain all the time. And it's just a reminder that there's no better time to start than now. And I say this because if you're thinking about getting into development, right now, like this very moment, there are not only a ton of jobs out there, but there aren't enough people to really fill them. And I don't know when that bubble is going to burst. So if you're thinking about coding, you're thinking about wanting to get into it, you've messed around a little bit, or you just like the idea of building cool stuff for the web or for computers, then take a deep look at your situation in life right now and see if it's something that you can fit in there. The easy decision is always going to be, I can start tomorrow because tomorrow never comes, right? Like that cliche. It's easier to tell yourself that you're going to wait another day or another week to start because that doesn't put any pressure on you to actually do the thing that you wanna do. But putting that pressure on yourself and actually starting it and taking that first step is half the battle. And there are a lot of people on YouTube, not just me, but like Chris Sean and Coding Phase and a bunch of other people that can attest to the fact that getting into programming, getting into development can change your life. It can change your life in a lot of ways. You can find more fulfillment at work or you will have a better work-life balance or you're gonna make more money. And just a lot of things can happen depending upon what you wanna get out of it that are completely true. So the quick tip for the day or the point of this short video is don't wait another second go log into Codecademy and hop on the HTML, CSS train. Or if you've already looked at code, you have a little bit of experience, but you really need to like hammer down your skills. There's a link to Treehouse below. It's an awesome way to learn how to code. Uh, you can click that, take a free trial, see if you like their teaching style. If you don't, there's thousands of other resources. There's YouTube tutorials. Uh, Udemy runs a great website that has topics on everything from code, uh, web development, game development, business stuff, uh, growth, marketing kind of things for like starting a company. Just hop on to what it is that you wanna do, like what your goal is for 2017 to get into the industry and just do it, just take that first step. The longer you wait to take that first step, the longer you wait to learn how to make a header in HTML or to change font size in CSS is another second closer to you not doing the thing that you wanna do. And I know that there's a lot of information out there and it'll be overwhelming and it can seem like this is a never ending process or that you'll never end up understanding what it is that you need to understand to be able to get a job as a web developer or whatever it is you wanna be. But that's just simply not the case. It takes drive and it takes passion and most importantly, it takes you actually like putting in the work. Put aside an hour or two hours sometime like today and pick it up. Go for it. Alright guys, so that's all I have for today. I know this was a short video, but next week I'm going to be filming probably a series of three videos that are a roadmap for success when it comes to trying to learn how to code at a certain time frame. So three months, six months, and a year. So if that's something that you'd be interested in, feel free to hit the subscribe button down below and get notified when those videos come out. If you liked this video, please feel free to hit that like button because they make me smile. And if there's anything else that I can help you with or if you have any questions on how to get started, anything like that, feel free to click the comment button and leave me a line down there or you can send me an email. It's aaronandbeta at gmail.com. Once again, and as always, thank you guys for your support and I will see you again soon. Bye.